most people think that fasting means you can't eat the entire day? We fast from dawn to dusk, so what about overseas? Do we go to the toilet less during Ramadan? Because we eat less and don't drink at all. And what's the importance of dates? I mean, you know, the food, the food dates, not the dates dates, yeah. So it's Ramadan again and it's one of the holiest months in the year for a lot of our Muslim friends out there. It's been a hidden good tradition to break fast and do iftar together and this year is no different. We've had a whole bunch of friends gather around the table for dinner tonight of different faiths, different backgrounds, including some friends who are not even Muslim but have been fasting for the whole month of Ramadan this year. And most importantly, we wanted to address a lot of the common misconception as well as answer a lot of questions that our friends had about fasting and Ramadan. I've been fasting for the past two Yes. I want to know more about how Muslims feel during fasting, during Ramadan. One of the prophetic traditions to actually have dates and milk together when you break fast, for example. Uh, but more importantly also, like when you break fast, it's advisable for you to actually break fast with something sweet. So people actually use the dates as something sweet for you to break fast with. Immediately you can start breaking fast, so you can have a date now. What do you all normally have for breakfast? Do you, all normally, do you all like purposely have a very heavy breakfast in the morning? Some people wake up and they just eat breakfast as per normal. Some people select breakfast that has a higher energy rate, so they focus more on carbohydrates. Some people eat dates because it has a lot of long-lasting energy. Uh, some people, most people, should hydrate themselves a lot. At what age do Muslims start fasting? Like, is it like, like a kid must also fast? Muslims are required to fast at once they hit puberty. However, um, what parents are encouraged to do for their children right, is to get their children to start fasting at a much earlier age so that when the time comes when they need to fast at the age of puberty, it becomes easier for them to do so as they have become accustomed to fasting. Can you have sex during Ramadan? After you break fast, technically you can have sex, you can have sexual activities after you break fast. However, you try not to because Ramadan is about abstinence, not just during fasting, but during the month itself. It's the holy month of Ramadan. So you try to abstain from your temptations, from extreme emotions, from addiction. Can I think or talk about food while fasting during Ramadan? The thing about fasting is not only to abstain from eating or drinking, but it's also to abstain from your worldly desires and your, you know, your thoughts and your emotions. So if you, when you think about food, you think about uh, I'm hungry, I'm going to like... So that is something that you should abstain from. But if you, if you think about, you know, like, what you're going to prepare for your family and all that, that's fine. Yeah. What if your profession requires you to consume food or to taste stuff or, you know, you're a professional chef? Some uh, opinions, for example, they believe that if you need to taste, you can taste, but you have to uh, throw it out uh, and rinse your mouth uh, thoroughly because as long as the food like in liquid form or whatever form does not enter your throat, it's okay. But there are some people who are stricter and they wouldn't actually allow that. So it really is up to the opinion of like the individual and you know, at the end of the day, it's really about your niyat, your intention, like what is it that you have to do. So say for example, if you're a chef and you're really doing it because it's your job, then take the next Necessary precautions. Now. We hope the questions and answers were as interesting and useful to you as they were to us. But if you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to ask them in the comment box below and share this video with some of your friends. Salamat Hari Raya to all our Muslim friends out there and we'll see you soon. Salam.